fire reporting. Chapter 3, fire reporting. 3.1 fire reporting. Emergency telephone numbers. All files must be reported to the Garrison Fire Emergency Service regardless of the size amount of damage, whether or not they have been extinguished. All fires will be investigated by the Garrison Fire Emergency Services. B. Immediately notify the fire notify the Garrison Fire Emergency Services of all of all known suspected fires that activity fire alarm and to ensure the timely response. Do not rely on automatic fire alarm transmittal to keep calm. Speak slowly. Stay on the line until the fire emergency services dispatcher tells you to hang up. Have some met of the fire emergency services on arrival for additional information. When reporting an emergency, provide the following information. Fire emergency services dispatcher 1. Location building number, name of housing area, name of street 2. Your emergency fire is chemical. Fill gas leak or medical emergency. Exact location of the fire and EG kitchen A at Pack Basement 4. All call back telephone number B. Emergency telephone numbers as as follow local 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 by dial. Military DSN emergency lines in Germany are wide or 117. From civilian phone to a, a US Army garrison bomb home with their civilian phone emergency at 6117. Outside local exchange emergency 067. 83-6117 U.S. Army Garrison Bomb Holder Civilian Emergency Outside Local Exchange Non-Emergency 0678367572 U.S. Army Garrison Bomb Holder Civilian Phone Emergency Outside Local Exchange Germany Phone 0678322386 Each telephone shall have the decaled emergency telephone attached to the phone building manager Manager, manager and evacu evacuation coordinator is responsible for compliance with the requirement decals are available from the Garrison Fire Emergency Services. Personnel, three, two, personnel actions in the event of a fire. All alert everyone, do not panic. Close all the doors, windows to prevent the fire from spreading. Exact the buildings when notified the fire hearing and the fire alarm. Take special care of the children, elderly, handicapped persons. Move up, wind in open areas. Notify Garrison Fire Emergencies from upon even the building, building of a fire alarm is activated. Do not return. Do not re-enter the fire. Do re not re-enter until the senior fire emergency services official at the scene gives a, gives a all clear. Three three classification of fire types of fire fire types of agents. Fire fire different. Di fire is divided into five material classes. The type extinguishes dependent upon the classifier. One a organic materials. Fires of organic materials such as paper, wood, and cloth ex exposures, etc., for this type of this extinguished with water. B. Chemical class B are petroleum, oil, lubricants, POLs, or fire, fires of flammable combustible liquids such as gasoline, oil, paint, or cooking fat. Or class B fires are extinguished by carbon dioxide, CO2s, or dry chemical power. Never use the water on gases. Or class B fires. Class C. Fire involves energized electronic electrical components such as live wires motor transformers electrical appliances extinguisher agent applied on the class C fires must not be conducted electricity fire extinguish agencies for the use of class C fires are carbon dioxide CO2 dry chemical powder never use water on class C fires class D combustible D fires are least frequently all fires use involved um, uh, fires and involve custom combustible metals such as magne magnesium, titanium, lithium, and aluminum. Unless an extinguisher agent is specially designed for the rated of the Class B fire is available, do not extend to extinguish a fire. A violent reaction may occur when the wrong extinguisher agent is used. Class K um, combustible cooking fires involve vegetable oils, fats of a cooking appliance. This commercial kitchen includes the following of a restaurant, cafeterias, fire and extinguishers, agents labeled with the letter K and are most suitable for the use of class K fires. 3-4 Basic Fire Suppression Procedure Fire incipient is, is the incipient stage is the easiest to extinguish their available fire suppression capabilities must be fully utilized to delay an early firefighting action gives the t fire time to spread the initial attack should be made by the base of a fire firefighting action conducted by little uh, at least two persons a single person can easily be overcome by heater and smoke remove high veil allow the equipment security files from the area when safely possible close doors windows to control the spread of fire Exci exercise caution around fires that are appear 
referred to the extinguished flashback causes by the flashbacks caused by vapors and hot surfaces may occur applied fo following fo fundamental principles that would include all fire state situations. One, report immediately to the garrison fire emergency service. Two, evacuate non-essential personnel. Three, firefighters incipient in the smoke development permits do not equip the combat of full-fledged maze of fire. Three, four, the closed door and windows to prevent the fire and smoke of the spreading. Five, the report on high-value equipment mission is essential items and classified materials as safe as possible. Three, five, leading cause of fires. Some careless, careless special cooking left untended in kitchen stoves leading to cause of fire. Soldiers would as well as every civilian and family member also as demonstrates a responsible fire prevention as the other life safety habits will recognize that we eliminate the fire hazards at the home or at work or during recreational activities as apathy, indifference, and lack of interest in life safety will not be tolerated. 3.6. Personnel liability. Per AR 735-5, Chapter 14, Section 3, a member is financially responsible up to one month's pay of the simply negligence or total liability for the gross negligence in the United States for the damage to any assigned quarters or related to equipment to furnish or furnishings. Um, 3.7. Fire dollar loss estimate. In eventually fire incident, the unresponsible for the damage is required to submit within five working days a written cost estimate of encouraged damages investigation official of the Garrison Fire Emergency Services. Chapter 4. Training Program. 